Chuck here. All right, good morning everyone from Karachi, Pakistan's biggest city, home to a whopping 20 million people. So it's big, it's busy. Today we're gonna head out for the first time and see what it's like. We're gonna start the day with some breakfast. We're gonna head into here. Salam alaikum. And it is busy, so you know it's gonna be good. What are these cricket players? Sit here? Okay, okay, here it's good. Yeah, okay, go on, Lee. Yeah, we got all the cricket lads in. Right, busy spot, you can never go wrong. How are you? Come, come. How are you? Where Very are you good, from? sir. From England. From England, yes. nice to meet you. What are you all doing? Cricket? Yeah, yeah, yes. we just Cricket. came back after winning the match. Oh, you've won? Yes. Yeah, you've oh, won the match. It's a tournament. Yeah. Oh, okay. How you are, long you are staying here? We are here for one week. One week? Yes, correct. So, so where are you staying? In which hotel? It's just around the corner, I can't remember the oh, name. Oh, okay, okay. So is there an issue you're facing right now? No, no, we just come for some breakfast. Okay. Some, oh. some chai, some paratha. If you want to enjoy with us, then come. Let's join okay. us. No problem. Okay. Alicia, you have to sit on these clubs? What do you have it? Yeah, so basically after winning, we came here, basically it's a very famous uh, oh, really? breakfast okay. place. So we, have, we are going to order some paratha. Okay, you, you, heard the, you heard the name of paratha, yeah? It's, it's very oily. We have never eaten in Pakistan, so first time so to it's, try it. It's very tasty. It's oily, okay. it's, very, it's very fat inside, okay, but that's definitely okay. we'll enjoy okay. it. <laughs> yeah. well, that's good for you, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Yes. Whatever is bad for you is good. <laughs> so we'll sit on the end here, right? With the cricket lads. How's your trip here? Pakistan, very good. It's good? It's very good, yes. Where have you been? Just Lahore. Just Lahore? Yes, and then Karachi. Lahore is very nice. Uh, did you went to Bajshai Masjid? Yeah, it's beautiful. It's very beautiful mosque, yes. When, when are you visiting Balochistan? Balochistan? Yeah. We can. Uh, we, we are not allowed we, to go to Balochistan. Foreigner need NOC. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. For the foreigner, basically, I have a planned visit in Balochistan. Okay. But uh, the person there is not allowing me to travel by road. Oh, yeah. So, yes. due to election and the, some... Uh, some issues, issues, political issues, I can say. Yes, okay, okay. But it's very beautiful. So, uh, Balochistan looks very beautiful. Very yeah. So, is, is this place uh, Balochistan food? No? Yeah, it's... Uh, they, 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 the people, they people are people from, are from Balochistan, Balochistan, am I right? Yeah. Yeah. I'm Balochistan. also from Balochistan. You're from Balochistan? Yeah. People are from Balochistan. Okay. Koita is the beautiful place of Balochistan. Koita? Koita, yeah. Koita, this Koita, is the okay. Koita Langi Hotel. Oh. So, here's, here's he a Koita Chai. Yeah, Koita Chai. Koita Chai. This guy is from Koita. Oh, you from Quetta? Yes. Oh, okay. Okay. It's very, there are very adventurous places, especially the Makran uh, Coastal Highway. That's very beautiful. The Coastal Highway. Yeah, the Coastal Highway. That sounds good, doesn't it, Lee? Yes. I'm excited because it smells really good. It smells good, doesn't it? It's really busy. We have to ask what, what they recommend. So everyone just getting paratha. Do you want any egg? Um, let's have a quick look. What do you recommend most delicious? The, the famous thing is paratha. Okay. And the chole. Chole. Chole, yes. Oh. It's, it's some, some spice there. If okay. you like a spice, then it's good for you. Fit okay, for you. spicy is good, yeah. yeah. And, and the cup of tea. Yes, yeah. So the, the, Qu Quetta chai. Yeah. Tea means. Kancha, yeah. But just ask that you want egg or not. What do you then want? Omelette or something? No omelette, just paratha. <laughs> so what, what makes the chai quetta chai? How is it different? Uh, it's it's their raw, raw material. The quantity of the... We are out of vocabulary. You know, you know it's very famous here. It is not true. It's famous that they use drugs. But it's not true. Okay, okay. Oh, that's an exciting fucking layer. You had the tapal Lipton tea. Uh, Lipton tea. Lipton tea. Yeah, in your product, Lipton. Yeah, yeah. They have a special flavors on it. Okay. They have special flavors. I think there is something in that. Yeah. Oh. We don't know. Oh, yeah. <laughs> They're putting something in it, the lace in the tea. Yeah. Alright, so first impression. These lads are all really nice. The people working in the restaurant are all very friendly. So, yeah, it looks cool. Can't wait for the day. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Oh. So they have a lot of different types of paratha and they have keema. Is the ke keema paratha good? It's, uh, we haven't tried, but definitely the place is very good. Okay, the perfect. The place is very famous, you can find every food. 
Oh, Delicious. super, super. But, but the keema is for maybe lunch or dinner. Lunch. Breakfast. Usually. Parata. Okay. Okay. Normal breakfast. Parata. Bit heavy. Kima is heavy, but I think we fancy something heavy. I think we might have to do it anyway. We'll bypass the breakfast. Because it is quite late, it's like what, 11? If you are not a fitness obsessed, you can eat anything. <laughs> yes, we will eat anything, yeah. <laughs> We're not cricket players like you lads, so. But we are sports fans, so we have to Yeah, you need to be healthy, yeah. yeah, yeah. We, right. de we definitely use our fats to utilize in the sports ground. Yep. <laughs> so, right, I'll just show you what we've got. So we got all different type of paratha, cheese paratha, chicken cheese paratha, chicken keema paratha, and a lot of sting energy drink, bloody hell. Right, this is a really good menu. Halwa. What should we get, Leesh? I think maybe we should get paratha. Maybe, do you want to get a keema? I might get the keema, you know. Something with cheese in. What about you? I will eat normal paratha and then we can share. We can share? Yeah. And I can just see the team up behind, he's making tea like a big green, I don't know what the tea really is. Should we go and investigate? Should we investigate? When we order a tea, we'll investigate. Get a couple of teas in as well, some quetta shark. So let's have a see what we've got in here, see if we can go around. I've just seen them making the tea in something I've never seen before, these big pots. Oh. Assalamu alaikum. Hello sir. So th this is Quetta Chai. Oh, I'm just looking, just looking. <laughs> it's okay, don't worry. Don't worry, no English, no problem. So they make the tea in these big coloured pots. I've never seen this before. But this, what are we cooking over? It's very hot. So we've got the big milk pot there. And then, yeah, this is sick. Look at that. <coughs> Filtered straight into the little teapot. Look at that. Get some air into it. Superstar. Okay, shukriya. Super, thank you. Right, so that tea looks fantastic. Look at that, the tea man. Great. Who's here? Oh, bloody hell. Chani. Oh, ho, ho. Oh, okay. Super. It looks so good. We're going to have to go to bed, aren't we? Uh, tell it uh, Andachola. Andachola? In, in, in Urdu. In Urdu. Urdu, okay, okay. Andachola. What's this? Halwa? Yeah. Halwa. 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 Halwa? Halwa, Okay, okay. What are these just standards? Yeah. Bloody hell. Yeah, chicken chow. Chicken chow. Chicken chow. Chicken chow. My name is Ellis. Ellis? Yes. Ellis? He's asking what you want. Can we get one chicken keema and egg cheese paratha? Okay. okay. Shukriya. Big breakfast. Bloody hell. <laughs> right, so we've got the paratha. These are the standard and they look lovely and flaky. The halwa. The chane, which they said there's also another name for it. I forgot. It looks super heavy and there's an egg in there. It looks really good to be fair, doesn't it? Like? Let's try it. And then more paratha. Go on, let's try. <laughs> it looks really nice and crispy, doesn't it? It's really hot and fresh. Bloody hell. Well, you have to try it on its own first. Good. It's really good. It's like, see all the layers. It's so flaky. Okay, super. Yeah. Can you... Right, let's get stuck in then. This actually looks wonderful. Please say it's really good and it's super flaky. It's probably the flakiest paratha I've ever seen. So let's try with the um, this chickpea curry. And that looks fantastic. I mean, it looks heavy, but look at this. Oh, fantastic. That is so good. It's very rich. It's got a nice little kick to it. Oh, that's good. And the paratha, don't even get me started on that. How have they got it that flaky? Look, they're only small. But that, I mean, it's heavy though. Look how oily they are. They just fold into like a million layers. So let's try some with the egg. Eh? Let's break a bit of the egg off. Gosh, I didn't even wash my hands. 
Oh, well. Well, that goes on. What do you think, Lee? Let's get a bit of everything there. Let's get a pinch. Right. Mm. Very good. Very good. Okay, everyone, you might have thought we had enough food, but a couple more things have just arrived. So we've got a beautiful cheese paratha here, which again looks like a heart attack, but it looks so good. It's piping up. And then we've got a chicken keema paratha, which I'm going to break up because this looks heavenly. Look inside there. Look at that. We'll try that one first. We've got this little sauce to dip it in. <laughs> oh, tea. <laughs> Got all these teas, bloody hell. Very skilled man. Wow. Tea time. This is very good, but it's extremely heavy. I'll try and make a room here. Shukriya. Quite a chai. Yeah, this is good, I'm asking people. What, what you put in the tea? You put like a chai, chai mein dalte kya? Chai He's saying there's no drug, but no drug. Okay, he's choking it. <laughs> okay, the funny these lads. This is so heavy. It's so good. Go out. Turn into a food video. It's a feast, this. Then last but not least, let's try the cheese paratha. Go on leash, cheers. Very hot. Choosing with cheese that. Well though. No, I never had a cheese paratha. No. It's like actually got cheese in the middle of that. <laughs> a lot of cheese. Usually they skimp on it here. It's, this is full of cheese. Right, everyone, let's finish everything. Because we got a lot of food. Can't be forgetting this tea, the Quetta Chai. Cheers, Leash. It looks so good. Look at that. I'm excited to try this. Everyone's told us this is the best tea. Go on, you first. <laughs> Oh, it's so good. You know why? It's extremely strong tea. It is what my street That is really good. Oh, that's good. That's, that's a proper brew, that is a strong dark tea. Oh, that's well good. It's sweet as well, but the sweetness isn't the main taste. It's more like, it's more strong tea, yeah. It's my kind of cold tea, that. Oh, look at that. Cheers. The tea is fantastic. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's strong. strong. That's that's how it should be. You know, it's uh, it's such a. You have Indian audience. Do you have Indian audience? Yes. So tea is fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> you get the point. The what? No, you don't get it. God. He's lost it's it. A, it's a famous story. You should you should make a cap caption. Tea is fantastic. Okay. For your Indian audience. In they get annoyed. Yeah, oh, <laughs> here's a political point. Okay, actually. okay, okay. <laughs> One last thing, but yeah, it never ends. So we got to try the halwa, and it looks well good, doesn't it? What's in there? Some like raisin sultanas, a little bit of nut. So we'll try first with a bit of paratha. Try and get some pinched up. There we go. Let's see how this is. Mm. Very good because it's not, it's not extremely sweet. Try it, Leish. Try it on its own. Yeah, it's more mild than I was expecting. It's not that sweet at all, no. That's it. Yeah. It's good. That's nice at the end of the meal. I forgot to say this, whatever this is, what is it, cumin, yoghurt, whatever mix, is very good to pull you down when you're eating this fucking heart attack food. Whoa, what's this? We've got a monkey in the street on a lead. Flipping hell, what's going on there? So I've just asked 
I'm guessing this is one of the boss men, Worthy Girl of Paratha. And he's brought me over here. Oh, we don't have any going on though, but this is where they um, do all the work. Salam alaikum. Hello, lad. Oh, so here they are. Okay, super. And he's got Manchester top on. Manchester. No good. <laughs> he doesn't understand me. So you can see in there the lads are all chopping up the door and portioning it ready for ma making you know, the individual parathas and they just go on here fry up nicely I don't know what's going on here, what are we having a conversation about? What's going on? I don't know Okay. I don't understand, but it's okay. Okay? Okay, thank you. So I what? Mean, this is English, no speaking. Oh, no worries, no problem. This is Pakistan, Urdu. Pashto, Urdu. Urdu, okay. So what, what is your hotel name? This is Quetta Alamgir Hotel. Quetta Alamgir. Uh, and this is Quetta. Okay, so this is the spot. I'll probably put this place in the description. It's really good. You can see it's busy. I just thought there's someone has a man with a monkey in the street. I'd... What's going on there? Your beard is very impressive. I have paid for You pay for us? Yeah, yeah, you are our guest. You are our guest. Thank you so much. Thank you, Okay, enjoy that trip. I hope you will find people like us. <laughs> yeah, Pakistani people are so nice. Yeah, they are such so nice people. Yeah. Thank you so much. Thank Enjoy the trip. Do, do text me. I will write to you. Yeah, yeah. don't worry, I'll text Thank you. Sure. Thank you. Thank you so much. I really no appreciate problem. it. No okay. well, that's super kind. See you later. Right, nice to meet you all. Okay. Shukriya, it was very good, super. Okay. Bye. Right. Hopefully, breakfast experience. Yeah, so we literally just jumped out of that rickshaw here. These lads have shouted us over. We paid for all that food, like we had we had a feast. Okay, super. Okay, shukriya. Goodbye. Allah Hafiz. What was I saying? I was just saying, just invited us. We all had a big feast together. Really nice lads had a nice chat, and they were very, you know. Pakistani hospitality. What do you reckon it? It's up there. Yeah, I've got some stories to tell you as this video goes on. But about Pakistani hospitality, off camera. But let's get away from this area. Let's go for a walk, yeah. Past Mr. Bloody Monkey Man, eh? What's he doing with that monkey? What's he doing with that? No, thank you, sir. What's he doing? Why is there a man with a monkey? What's he doing with that? I'm not sure. Is it his friend? It might be his friend, yeah, his only friend. His pet. <laughs> He's got no mates. Look at this, burgers, street burgers. Right, the, sorry, there was a lot going on there, lots to digest. Um, you know what the man said to me? What did he say? He said, I can tell he's so very excited. <laughs> he's not wrong. Super happy to be here. We're having, we're having a really good time in Pakistan. Like, we're, every day has been so good, hasn't it? Yeah, it's been really, really lovely. And you just meet people, you can have really nice conversation, you can learn so much. Like, and I said to Ellis this morning, we planned our day, and I said, I guarantee it won't go to plan, but it's not a problem. Like, something will creep up, something will happen. And I've just proved my point there. <laughs> that, that is Pakistan for you. You can go out and say you're going to do this, and then next minute you've been called over by someone, you're, you're doing something else all day. It's mad. Because everyone's so inviting. Right, let's go for a walk, let's see what else we can. Um fine here in Karachi. Now I have no idea where we are, but yeah, it doesn't matter. Assalamu alaikum. Hello, how are we doing? I'm fine. You are good? Yes, sir. This is a tyre changing shop? Yes. Sir. Yes, okay. We've just have been to the, you know, the Quetta Alamgir? Alamgir Hotel, Alamgir Welfare Trust and Hospital. Yeah, it was super. The Paratha, super. Yes. Okay. Nice to meet you, sir. Have a nice day, lads. My good name is Ellis. What's your name? Ali. Ellis. Ali. Ellis. My name is Atif. You from? Atif. 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 England, sir. 
Yes. You are Karachi? Yeah. Karachi? Okay. I'm gonna shoot. Okay, goodbye. YouTube channel, yes. I'll write it down for you. Have your phone? Okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Subscribe. Super. Great. Right. Nice to meet you. Okay. Goodbye, everyone. We need to go. Bye. See you later. So, that's a prime example of um, what happens to you everywhere you go in Pakistan. There's literally always somebody waving you over. Just have a little chat. But we'll, um, we'll just have a walk around and see what we can find because literally that, that's all we need to do. Because there's just so many interesting people and interesting things going on. I don't know where we are in Karachi, but it's not actually that busy around here. We've got some fruit stands here. And there's pavements. Maybe we're in quite a nice area. I think it looks like quite a nice area. A bit of a nice area, yeah. But let's just see. We'll see what we can find. the start of the morning though. You can't ask for anything better than that, really. Oh, definitely not. Lovely. And that's not even a one-off occurrence. It happens literally everywhere you go. Like, with or without the camera. What, should we tell everyone what happened yesterday? Yeah, go on. So we arrived to Karachi yesterday, this is your story time for you. We arrived off a bloody long train in the afternoon. What did we do? So we hopped, I ordered it like an in-driver, just a, a rickshaw to the room. And the guy was really lovely. He didn't really speak, say much, did he? No, not really. He didn't really say much. Then we got to our destination and I, at least we I went to pay, out. I went to my thing and he grabbed my hand and he said no. He wouldn't let us pay. Which is super kind for a bloody 15 minute drive. It took 20 minutes of his day to take us across the city and then we went for a little soda drink next to our house. We went tried to give the man the money. Again, just grabbed the hand. No. So yeah, even when you're not filming, people are super kind here. So I have to say that because that's important. Camera or no camera, people are still extremely hospitable. Oh my friend! If you text me, I will make a plan for okay. you. Okay. Okay. Super. Okay. Good luck, sir. Yeah. What the hell? Pakistan. Pakistan. Zindabad. Pakistan's in the van. Okay. What the hell? Right. Characterville. Character you are a vlogger? Yes, yes. You are a vlogger. Yes, vlogger, yes. What's your subject? Subject? Yeah. Just what travel. What kind of vlogging you are doing? Travel, Traveling? like just walking around, meeting people, eating, I don't know. Just having okay. fun. Okay, okay. Would you like to uh, visit our space? What is this? Uh, this is our school, it's the international. School? School. Oh, thank you very much, but we have to keep walking. So You're okay. keep walking. Okay. Okay. No. Thank you very much. I really appreciate it. It's lovely to you meet you. Yes. Would you like to take tea? Oh. Honestly, we have, so, kind of we have just had some quite a and we have had so much food. Like, <laughs> You're honestly. Already. Yeah, but thank you so okay. much. Okay. Thank so nice you. Of I really like your beard. It's bloody wonderful. <laughs> it's very nice. <laughs> Looking good. Thank okay. you. No, it's very nice to meet you. I appreciate Same the offer. Here. Thank Same you so much. Take care. Bye-bye. Okay. Goodbye. They're really nice. But, but they, this is the thing, right? Like, in, the amount of people who invite the place is ridiculous. Like, yeah, the, but where did he offer us to go? What's he asking us to go? International school, I think he says. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I, I mean. <laughs> but, but, my well, point is, professional people's do that. as nice as everybody is, genuinely, you know, we can't just we can't go through. Otherwise, we'll just never get anywhere. So we're not being rude, but we have we we have to carry on because we're making this video here first day in Karachi, just showing you some of the street scenes and whatnot. So I think people need to realise as well, it's really hard for us to say no to people because we're so polite. I, I can't say no, but like, yeah, okay, that's course, like the first time I've said no in the country, that. Yeah, no, we have to really like start. Oh, watermelon shop. Salam alaikum. I don't need, but they look very good. This is a watermelon, sir. Yes, I know it's a watermelon. It looks ah. very good. Yeah, very big. This is a red and a sweet. Sweet? Sweet. All right, but I, I can't take one. Back to the hotel. The hotel? Okay. okay, sir. Okay, but thank you. Thank you, sir. Very okay. good. Best of luck selling them all. Okay? Okay. As good as those watermelons look, I don't really know what we do. We want what? just carry it under my arm all day like a bowling ball. What? Why are they selling balloons here? Kids' balloons. Do you want a duck leash? A duck with an eye patch on? <laughs> Alright, let, let's find something interesting. Oh, that's interesting. A Pakistani truck. They're always extremely colourful. Look at that. Shukriya, thank you, sir. <laughs> what the hell? 
They brought as many welcomes to Pakistan as in Milan. Oh, hello, sir. <laughs> this is funny in Karachi, literally every single person who walked past the drive past, but he wants to chat more so than the whole. Yeah, no, the people are like really open, yeah? Really open. I know we've already eaten, but I just want to show you that when you just walk around, you can come across some right gems. So look at this, we've got a little kitchener, and then I'm just going to quickly show you the dishes in here. Like if we hadn't already eaten, I would go in here and eat, because look around here at all the dishes. You can see. So you've got all these different dishes to choose from. And let's be honest, they all look well good. Look at this. All over the heat, all bubbling, sizzling and fresh. Look at that. Oh, wow. Oh, it looks so good. I wish I wasn't full, sorry. Oh, it looks well good. But we can't eat. At least them dishes look really good. Really good. I know, because I just wanted to have a look. Okay. Shukriya. Maybe another day we come back, because honestly, it looks super. Okay, goodbye. I love this. Yep. That's what I mean, like, you don't need to go to famous places. That place looks top tier. Just have a wonder. Alright, so we're gonna head down this street because it looks interesting. Looks like we've got stuff going on, it's busy. You know, we've got all the bikes parked up. Look at this. What have we got? A samosa point. I mean, at this point, we're just walking around, just looking at what there is, being excited about everything. What have we got here? A little clock shop. It's a market area, isn't it? What do you think, Leash? There's just so much stuff, like clothes everywhere, clocks, a lot of clocks. A lot of clocks, yeah. It's just, it's just so much stuff. <laughs> really interesting though. I think as well it's good because there's a massive food culture here, which is like what we love. It's right up our so street, isn't it? Every single street has got so much food, tea. And the culture is eating yeah. with family and friends, like anywhere we have culture like that, it's just top, top tier countries. So there's all kinds going on. You can see, you can just walk down any street and you've got stuff to look at. Got bundles of clothes here. Let's have a look, see if you can get some new, new pants or something. Like Pajamas. What's this? Some pots this man's selling. Very nice pots there, aren't they? Very nice. All the old boys are here. Salam alaikum, hello. What have we got here then? Yeah, just like pants. A man with some pants. Salam alaikum. Some Gucci joggers. Wow, look at these. Get myself some new clobber, eh? Some of the real deal. Some new shorts, right. We don't need anything, let's clear off. Pajamas, okay. Shukriya. Yeah, they look like pajamas. Right, let's go. Look at this, the Karachi buses, look at them. Very, very colourful. We're all going to have to get one of them at some point. Now you can actually sit on the roof. I think maybe people just do that when it's extremely busy, so who knows, maybe we'll do that at some point, if we can. If there's a lot of lads sat on the roof, we'll be up there with you. So here we go. I'll tell you what, I've just bought. Another shalwar kameez. Should we show everyone the colour quick while we're here? I didn't film it. I just thought, I've got a light one, let's get a dark one. So this was 3000 for the full set. It's kind of like a blue, green, grey, weird colour. It's alright. People are really nice. The service in shops, like, I don't, I don't know about this, it's a big fancy shop. It was just kind of like a small like, market shop. The service is phenomenal, like. They look after you. I've been in like shops like this and the service is nowhere near like if you go to like a small business. Yeah. They're so helpful. Really so, helpful. It's a small business forever. There's just no other way about it. It's always the best. F, the big corporations and the brands. You know how it is. We've just spotted this little juice stand here. So let's see what's going on. Hello, salam alaikum. Hello. So what have we got here? Like a tamarind drink and like a mojito drink. 
They're mad on the mint drinks. Okay. Um, how many rupee? Kidna rupee. Egg glass. Oh, it's here. It's on the side. Oh. Please can we get a uh, one one? Egg egg mint. Egg tamarind. <laughs> oh, do sorry, sorry. It's um. One. One. That's it. Uh, this one, this one. So we're gonna get one of each of these. And then hopefully, not get a belly ache. What's he got here? Is it like a syrup drink? What are we on? There's a lot of flies flying around. What have we got? It's like syrup. Oh gosh. God, this is unhealthy. Oh well, so these are 30 each, I think, a glass. Which is extremely affordable. What else is he putting in here? What's he got? Some type of liquid. Oh, it's water. Oh, Ooh, it's water. What do you think? Should we get one of each, just the one? Okay, just this. Okay? Shukriya. Alright, we're just on this one. We won't get the mojito one. I have the first sip. Oh, it's nice, it's sour because it's the tamarind. Hey, it's alright too far. It's refreshing. I try that, Lee. Yeah, it's a good taste. Good tamarind taste. Let's just hope the stomachs stay strong. It's very good. It's very good. Good. Super. Good. I'm gonna have to tuck in and drink this somewhere because we've got the bloody beggar entourage. Again, pulling on my shirt. Shukriya, sir. Okay? I think it's 30. It's okay, it's okay for you. Okay, shukriya, bye. Goodbye. Right. So hopefully, we're gonna survive the street juice. Let's try and get through. Oh, we can get through. Yeah, look, okay. Okay. Do we have a squeeze? Oh, Leisha's got new pants on. Leisha's also got new gear on. Well, this is this top is actually for India, but new pants. So as much as I am absolutely loving Karachi, it seems the child beggar problem here is ruthless. Like it's really bad. Like we just got kids that just follow us for like 40 minutes and just nonstop like tugging our clothes and stuff. No matter what we do, they won't leave us alone. Even if people tell them to leave us alone, they won't leave us alone. So it's quite bad. And we don't give to child beggars. It's like rule one. But it is what it is. And it does make it hard to enjoy something because like we're trying to look at stuff and enjoy stuff, chat to people and then when you've got some content like pulling on you and stuff. I'm keeping it real. Now you might say, why don't you give to the child beg as well? By doing that you kind of encouraging them and teach them that it's okay to do that. So it's just a bit of a vicious cycle so enough of that, it is what it is. So we've come down another market street and we've got some street kebabs and orange juice and sugar cane. Assalamu alaikum. Hello, sir. Shall we get a sugar cane? I think we should, yeah. Okay. We're going all out today. Um, how much for one glass? Egg glass? Can we get one, please, sir? Got some ice? Uh, can we get no ice? Okay. No ice. Let's see. I can't risk it too hard. What's he got? He's got oranges. Grapefruit. Hey, you can get a fresh juice as well. But we're getting our first Pakistani sugar cane. You can see, he's got the gear here, look at this. The mechanism. Oh, the hell, don't get your hand caught in that. You won't have an hand anymore. So what's he gonna do? Where's the sugar cane coming from? Has he gone to get it? Has he gone to get it? Oh my gosh. All the sugar cane's there. Oh, okay, here we go, everyone. 
Scratchy, I think that's the most flies of any I've seen in my life. It's like a flymageddon. There it goes. So there's our sugar cane coming out. Nice. Great. Right. Let's see how this is. So it's just a little market street where we've got paraffa rolls, crispy rolls. They look good, they look heavy though. Yeah. Are we risking it too much? Oh, no, let's play on the wild side eh? Oh, that's, this is my thoughts. If we go in as hard as possible, drink everything, eat everything, don't care about anything and we're okay, we can handle anything. Let's not be careful, let's just do it. Just one. So there we go, it's all foamy, look at that. So he sieves it into the glass. Right. Let's see how it is. Let's try not drink a fly through the straw. Thank you, sir. Okay, here. Let's try. Here's our first sip. Sugar cane. It's the same everywhere in the world, it's always top tier. Does it even need ice? Not so hard. We need that. It's refreshing, it's sugary. It's sweet. Really sweet. Hey, it's alright. I think he said 60 glass as well. Neck it. Down it, down it, down it. I'm so full that breakfast was absolutely massive. It usually leaves you like stuffed for the full morning. Hey, there we go. Quick refreshment. Right, there we go. A quick em. Let's see. Did you say 60? 60. Oh, for goodness sake, the big notes got a thousand. Is there anything smaller? Like? Shukriya. Goodbye. I love his. Hey, that was refreshing. Decent little stop. I don't know what to do now. I think we might head off home. And then end the video somewhere nice, somewhere special. Here in Karachi City. Right? Right. Right, geezer. Yeah, lose that. Quick and we just nipped into another shop because Leash never stops shopping. There's always more stuff to buy. So she's looking at this little number, two piece. Gear. Cute. We'll yeah, see how much it is. Yeah. Okay, shall I have to we'll see. So, how much is this set? One five hundred. Fixed price. Fixed price. Fixed price. Well, what do we think about that? Fifteen hundred. That's like four quid or something. Yeah. I don't know how much the minute costs. So. There she goes. It's in the shopping basket. New set. Always buying something, she is. Always buying something. Or trying to buy something. So, maybe we should try and actually catch that local bus home. Because our home is just like a 25 minute walk down here. Might be easy to just jump on local bus. Maybe that's what we'll do. Right, there's a bus here. I don't know how we flag this down though. Can they see us? This bus, yeah? Oh. We'll try and get this bus here, a local bus. Wow, wow it's very beautiful, isn't it? Half yeah. yearly. Okay, shukriya. Gosh, it's tall. Oh, it's busy in here, isn't it? Look at this. Oh, it's, it's a full bus as well. Is that a stand-up job? Just stand-up. So we'll just stand, I guess. I don't know how much this local bus will be, but check it out. I mean, it's um, very colourful and it's very full. So we'll just stand, it's okay. It's saying go back there, Lee. Chaotic. Okay, okay, these lads are letting us sit. Gosh. I think we're getting off in a minute before we sat down. Leash has got a seat, it's all good. Thank you very much. Okay, I'm going to go to the back. Check it out.
get out of the local bus in Pakistan. It's colourful, isn't it? Look, look at the trimmings for the roof. It's a nice bus. <laughs> How much is it? We need to give the man some money, don't we? Let's see, let's see. Let's go with it. Leisha's over there having a right chat with her lady she's sat next to. The mild things, aren't they? Get the rupee. Yes. 100. 100 for two people? Excuse me, sir. Okay. It's 50 each. So the bus is full, right? Like, look, we're all uh, sandwiched in. Oh, we need Hello. to get off here. I think. Yes. Hello. I think we need to get off. Leash. I think we're off here. Are we? Yeah, we get off here. So for some reason the bus is now heading over a highway in the complete opposite direction. Even though I told the bloke we wanted to get off back there, he said no. So I don't know what's going on, but now we are very far away. We can't get to where we're going. And I just hit my head on the roof on the bar. Okay, thank you so. Okay, goodbye. Just another quick story for you while we're here. You see this Shabazz Salon and Spa. So yesterday the hotel we're staying in, which is there, recommended going there for an haircut. Now I went in there, best flipping haircut service of my life, apart from, I'm a bit upset. The communication got lost, the beard's gone. I'm a bit distraught, but it is what it is, it'll grow back. But like the service, I think it was like 1,500. Oh, we've got a tornado. God. Oh gosh service was phenomenal like they kept doing things and doing things i was like is this not extra money and they were like no it's all included they're like looking at my hands saying i need a manicure i was like nah i just want to go to bed you know like washing my hair doing all this mad moisture a lot of madness service never had an urkel like it so big up to the lads it was a bit mad but the tea's all going on what's going on pakistan service in pakistan is like the best I've ever seen. It was an hour and a half haircut. Hey, and that's with me stopping and doing a lot of stuff because I just wanted to go to bed. It took his time. Right, everyone, we've just had a bit of a nap and now I've got my new clobber on. We're about to head somewhere nice to end this video. So we've just called an in driver, which is like the best taxi app to use. You can get rickshaws, cars, whatever. And it's like a bid system. So you like put in your price and they can like match your offer or offer higher. It's pretty good. It's very efficient actually, so we're just waiting for our mate now. And then we're gonna take you somewhere nice to end this first day here in Karachi. How are we looking though? How's Leash looking? How am I looking in the new gear? What do you think? Bought this today. Ready made. I think it looks alright, what do you reckon? I think it looks rather smart. Nice and baggy. Rather dashing. So yeah, we're off. Oh! Assalamu alaikum. How are you? Oh, we've got the same driver. <laughs> okay. Bloody hell, people. So, when I told you the story about our friend who picked us up from the train station, we'll charge. This is our friend. The bus. Toba Masjid. Masjid Toba. What's his name? What is your name, sir? Mohammed Ashid. Mohammed Ashid. Okay. Bloody hell, same man. Small world. Really nice, this guy. Genuinely. So, yeah, we just arrived into Karachi, and he just would not let us pay. Spent 20 minutes of his time driving us. Super nice guy. So let's go. Vamanos. Oh, speed bump. Here we go, Lee. We're off. Feeling good in the gear. Oh, I'll tell you what, it's super comfy this gear. The, the shell walk I mean. Is it's up there in comfort, it's like top tier comfort. Okay, sir. I will put it in for you here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So tomorrow, tomorrow, Pakistan video. Lahore, Karachi, inshallah. This vlog will be the... Maybe like one week. Okay. One week? Yes. I will see you in China. Thank you so much. Okay. Okay. Oh, yes. 
Are you sure? Yesterday. Because last time you took yeah, us for free. Yesterday. Yeah, people. No problem. Are you, are you sure? No. Are you sure? <laughs> so this man took us for free today. Now he's saying we don't have to pay again. Yeah. Okay, I offer one last time. Are you sure? No problem. Are you sure? Okay. The hospitality in Pakistan. Thank you so much. You are such a kind man. Okay. Best of luck with everything. Allah Hafiz. Okay. Wow. There he goes, Mohammed. That that man's ridiculous. So he did that the other day when we weren't filming. Like I kid you not. Like the first, he was the first man we met in Karachi. And again, like he wouldn't let us pay. So like you can keep offering and offering, but there's a point where. You know, you just I'm very grateful for the hospitality that we're receiving in this country because the people have been just fantastic. You've seen it. I, I can't say a bad thing. Wow. So here we are, Tuba Mosque. You can hear the call to prayer. We're going to take a quick look and end the video in here. Legend, him, isn't he? He's such oh, no. a nice guy. I said to him, no, you did this yesterday. We need to make sure he doesn't accept any more of our jobs on the in drive. We're going to have to decline him. Otherwise, we're going to put him out of business. It's just about, it's not about the money, is it? It's obviously, you've got to appreciate them, the people here. Anyway, enough talking. Assalamu alaikum. Can we take a look at the mosque? No, this is a prayer time. Just outside? No. No? No, it's not allowed. Right then, here we are, prayer time has just finished. So we're going to take a walk around. This is Tuba Mosque. It's very big. I've never seen one like this. It's a big dome and it's very nice. So we're going to walk around this garden area, which is again, a very well kept garden area. It's nice in here. So yeah, this is where we're going to end the video. So we'll take a little lap round and then we'll round things off outside. Check it out. The tower. It's an impressive building. Now we're not going to go inside, we're not going to intrude because we did come at prayer time and I don't think many tourists come here, many foreigners, because I don't think they were too impressed with us being here. I don't know why, but there was a bit of a, a hostile vibe in the air. But I don't know what. Yeah, I agree. We were being very respectful, we weren't being disrespectful or anything, we just, we were just. We understood it was prayer time, we were just saying, okay, we will wait until prayer time is over and then we just want to take a look because you know when there's a nice building like this, a religious building, we want to have a look. But enough of that. Let's just have a look. It's really beautiful, the garden. It is nice, isn't it? Look at it. It's peaceful as well. So you're in the middle of the city. You can't hear any of the noise from the city. So. There we go everyone, look at this blue sky today, we've had a, a lovely day. So we'll finish in a minute, Salam alaikum. Right. Just realised I'm the worst YouTuber ever and I never filmed an outro to this video when we left the mosque. So here we are a day later. What a first day here in Karachi, we met so many nice people, experienced proper Pakistani hospitality, fantastic. So yeah, cheers for watching, see you in a bit.